Positive, comparative, and at the end of this video lesson, you are expected to identify positive and the comparative adjectives and able to compare two nouns in a given sentences. For a start, do the following exercise. You can pause this video if you will need more time. Press play again when you are finished with the activity and when you are ready to proceed with the lesson. Match the names of some objects or things and animals in column A to the words that describe how are they different from each other. In column A, number 1, dog, cat. Number 2, goat, caravan. Number 3, rose, sampaguita. Number 4, horse, giraffe. Number 5, helicopter, airplane. Column B, a. B. Bigger B. Fast Faster C. Tall Taller D. Fragrant More fragrant E. Small Smaller Here are the answers. Number 1. E. Number 2. A. Number 3. D. Number 4. C number 5b. For the recap, we have learned that a suffix is a letter or group of letters added at the end of a word and it changes the meaning of that word. It can help you figure out the meanings of new words you encounter. Now, we are going to study positive and comparative degrees of adjectives. First, let us define what adjectives are. Adjectives are words that describe nouns, things, people, places. Can you find the adjectives in these sentences? Number 1. The tall woman. Number 2. The big car. Number 3. He is happy. Number 4. The math problem is complicated. Number 5. He is a good painter. Number 6. The sock smells bad. The underlined words describe only one person or one thing. They are in the positive degree. For comparative degree, we compare two things. Read and understand the given sentences. Number one, the woman is taller than the girl. Number two, the bus is bigger than the car. Number three, the boy is happier than the man. Number four, Division is more complicated than addition. Number five, the teacher is better painter than the pupil. Number six, the fish smells worse than the sock. Verb to be is used before a comparative adjective. Then goes after a comparative adjective. How did we come up with those answers? Number one, the most typical comparative is the use of ER after an adjective, like in the example. The woman is taller than the girl. We simply add ER onto a regular adjective tall plus ER equals taller. Example, short plus ER shorter. Loud plus ER is louder. Quiet plus ER is quieter. Fast plus ER is faster. For number two, look at the next sentence. The bus is bigger than the car. The comparative adjective bigger is another case. The root word big is very short. It has only one syllable. Always remember that if the word ends with consonant, vowel, consonant, for CBC, we need to copy the last letter of the word, which is G, and 
add er to make it bigger. Example, hotter, fatter, sadder. For number three, this is another case. Another case of adjective ending in y like happy. The sentence is, the boy is happier than a man. The word has two syllables. We change y into i and add er. Example, happier, shinier, heavier, bumpier. Number four, not all comparative adjectives have er in the sentence. For example, division is more complicated than addition. If the adjective is long or has two or more syllables, we use more or less before the comparative adjective. The adjective complicated has four syllables, com, pli, k, tet. We do not add er to long adjectives, two or more syllables, except for the words that end with y. Some two-syllable adjectives add er, others do not. Example, more serious, more colorful, less difficult, less popular. For number five, irregular adjectives. This means not regular. We do not add er or more or less. Read the next sentence. The teacher is a better painter than a pupil. The fish smells worse than the sap. If we are going to put good and bad in comparative form, the adjective good was changed into better, and the adjective bad was changed into worse. Now it's your turn. Write P if the sentence is positive, and C if it is comparative. Number 1. The earth is larger than the moon. Number 2. The classroom is clean. Number 3. Your grade is worse than mine. Number 4. That person seems angry. Number 5. The little girl is more polite than her sister. The answers are number 1 C, number 2 B, number 3 C, number 4 B, and number 5 C. For activity 1, which is which? Answer each question. Write your answers in your notebook. Number 1. Which is bigger, a city or a barangay? A. City is bigger than a barangay. B. Barangay is bigger than a city. C. Town is the biggest place in the country. Number two, which is more beautiful, a new doll or an old toy? A. A new doll is more beautiful than an old toy. B. An old toy is more beautiful than a new doll. C. All the toys are beautiful. Number 3. Which is lesser? 10 or 100? A. 10 is lesser than 100. B. 100 is lesser than 10. C. 1,000 is lesser than 100. Number 4. Rene is 8 years old. Ryan is 9. Who is older? A. Rene is older than Ryan. B. Ryan is older than Rene. C. Roy is the eldest among the three. Number 5. Miguel weighs 80 pounds. Manuel weighs 75 pounds. 
who is lighter? A. Miguel is lighter than Manuel. B. Manuel is lighter than Miguel. C. Nobody is lighter than Miguel and Manuel. The answers are number 1A, number 2A, number 3A, number 4B, and number 5B. For activity 2, write the comparative form of the following adjectives. Number 1, new. Number 2, long. Number 3, expensive. Number 4, thin. And number 5, pretty. Here are the answers. For adjective number 1, new, the comparative is newer. For adjective number 2, long, the comparative is longer. For adjective number 3, expensive, the comparative is more expensive. Number 4, thin, the comparative is thinner. And for adjective number 5, pretty, the comparative is prettier. For activity number 3, fill in the blanks with the comparative form of the adjectives in the brackets. Number 1, the word in the bracket is hot. Your tea is blank than mine. Number two, there are many healthy foods that taste blank than junk food. The word inside the bracket is good. Number three, Superman could travel blank than a speeding bullet. The word in the bracket is fast. Number four, my sister's breakfast is blank than me. The word in the bracket is delicious. Number five, junk food is blank than healthy food. The word in the bracket is cheap. The answers are number one, hotter, number two, better, number three, faster, number four, more delicious, and number five, cheaper. Fill in the blanks with the correct words to wrap up everything that we have talked about this lesson. Choose your answer from the box. The words inside the box are copy, two syllables, two nouns, more or less, and comparative. Number one, we add ER to the adjectives when comparing blanc, blanc. Number two, the most typical blanc is the use of ER after an adjective. Number three, always remember that if a word ends with consonant, vowel, consonant, we need to blank the last letter of the word. Number four, if the word has blank and it ends with Y, we change Y into I and add ER. Number five, if the adjective is long or have two or more syllables, we use blank before the comparative adjective. results to someone else. You can never be another person. You can only be a better version of yourself. Never give up on what you love to do the most. For the post test, read the sentence carefully and choose the correct adjective. Number one, an elephant is blank than a mouse. A. Bigger B. Smaller C. More Gigantic
Number two, the moon is black than the sun. A. More close. B. Closer. C. The closest. Number three, English is blank to learn than Spanish. A. More easy. B. Easy. C. Easier. Number four, a desert is blank than a mountain. A. More flattest. B. More flat. C. Flatter. And number five, a rock is blank than a pillow. A. Harder. B. More hard. C. Hardest. Here are the answers. Number 1A. Number 2B. Number 3C. Number 4C. And number 5A. Goodbye and see you in our next lesson.